Hey guys, so check this out. I'm at home on quarantine, as is most of the world, and my wife just asked me if I could do a little project in our kitchen to try to make it look a little bit better. I'm not gonna go out and get any supplies, so I'm trying to think about how to do this project with some of the scraps that I have here at the house. So I have a few, I think I have three pieces of really long lattice, like, like this, but I don't have enough, and so I'm actually going to make my own out of this piece of wood right here. I'm gonna rip it down, uh, to be the same width, and then I should have enough lattice that I need. We're basically going to create a, a section of our wall. You've seen it before, it's nothing fancy, but it does help things look a little bit better. And then I'm going to use, I think, those two bottom boards on the uh, on the wood rack right there and create a bench for our table. Um, so here's to a project that's kind of quick and, and hopefully easy, but using scrap wood, I'm also going to use my phone instead of my cameras because I'm going to try to get this done as quickly as possible. So uh, let's see what happens. Okay, so the first thing that I'm gonna do is I'm going to measure this piece to be the length of the boards that I'm gonna put on the wall so that once I rip them down, I don't have to cross cut multiple. I'll just cross cut it once now and then when I rip them down, they'll all be the same. Okay, so the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm, I've already set my fence to be the exact width, hopefully, of this piece of lattice here. So it slides down right in between the blade in the fence like so. So now I'm going to just simply rip this piece, which is already at the length I need, uh, and hopefully I'll get lots of little lattice pieces. So I actually redid our kitchen a couple years ago. These were just normal cabinets. Uh, we took the doors off, we painted them white, I built boxes on top of the cabinets and then took them all the way to the ceiling and added trim. So I also did the island that was here, painted it white, and then I added this lattice around the edges and added this centerpiece here as well to create this panel look. I'm gonna take the same look from here and apply it to that wall over there. Across the wall like this, one up here, one at the bottom, and then I'm gonna take these pieces I just cut outside and I'll actually section off the wall to make panels. Okay, so at this point we put the lattice on the wall and we evenly spaced the sections. This, these are the pieces that I ripped out of that board. Uh, we spaced them out evenly, tacked them up on the wall, I caulked all the lines, and now I puttied all the holes. And now we're going to wait for this to dry, then we're going to paint all of this white, and I think it's going to really dress up this side of the wall. All right, so after the paint dried, then we placed these pictures up on the wall. Uh, these pictures were painted by Ellen Brewer. You can find more art pieces like this and many others at ellenbrewer.art. These pieces added to our wall, I think really tie everything together. And with everything centered on the wall, I think that this project's done. That's it, this was quick and easy, and best part of all, it was free. A great use of our time at home on quarantine. Thanks so much for watching. If you'd consider subscribing, that'd be a great honor to me, and I'd really appreciate it. To see more projects like this, you can check out my Instagram at Tyson underscore more or TysonMoreBuilds.com. Thanks so much again for watching.